Hey guys, this is the Prepping Preacher channel. I'm Brother Tim. I'm so glad you're here. Hey, this is going to be a quick one, no intro to it. Uh, there's not, this is not about prepping. This is a state of the union of what our, what these United States have become. I just got in the house and I turned on the nightly lies, or as most of y'all know it, the nightly news, and was watching when a little blurb come up about Bob Woodward, which you can take that for what it's worth, his new book called Peril talking about the last days of the Trump administration, all these snowflakes were so afraid of the Trump administration. And in that book, I hear now that Benedict Arnold Milley, that's the chairman joint chief of staff. Here's his picture. You want to know what a traitor looks like? That's it right there. That's it right there. That's a traitor. He took steps with China. Now, while he was, and Trump got him in that position, while he was... <laughs> In the Pentagon, he took steps with China and called China, the generals over there, and told them that he would warn them if an attack was coming. His exact words, and I wrote them down. If we're going to attack, I'm going to call you ahead of time. It's not going to be a surprise. What is that like? Are you the one that ordered the nuclear bomb? We're not going to have a fight, is what he said. That's treason. And then he's talking with Pelosi in the background behind Trump. And, and we're, we sit here and say that there's all kinds of collusion going on. There's all kinds of stuff going on. That's deep state right there. That's the swamp that we've talked about. These guys are so infiltrated now that we can't trust our leaders anymore. Here they were subverting. They were, they were traitors traitors calling China. He had no right. He should he could he shouldn't call anybody. That's not his job. His job is to say, yes, sir. And that's it. That's it. Guys, this this is where our country's heading. It's they're gonna do what they want to do, how they want to do it. They've got an agenda. You better get ready because that agenda's coming to your door soon. Guys, I love you. I want the best. Until I see you again, I'm praying God will richly bless you. You'll continue to stand in that gap. We need some men of God. We need some women of God to stand up, man. This is the Prep and Preacher, guys. I'm out of here.